Hey you guys, welcome back to our day. It is super early in the morning. <laughs> it's actually, oh, see I bet that's my father-in-law. Dang it all. My ride is here, 15 minutes early. If you watched my video yesterday, I totally called it. And I'm not ready, so he's gonna have to wait. <laughs> he better not ring our doorbell. I've got two kids awake, ready for middle school and high school. I have to pay a bill online. <laughs> And so I, he has to wait. Abby, Abby, can you bring me my drink and go up and get my wedding ring? Please, really quick. See, that's Grandpa calling. Answer my phone and tell him I'll, I'll be out in a minute. Hurry. Okay, let me go and pay this bill really quick. All right, payment has been made. <laughs> Not gonna be late on our credit card bill. So, um, I couldn't do that yesterday because I had made all my deposits and paychecks and all that kind of stuff. And so I had to wait a day. Anyway. <coughs> Breakfast in a jar. Um, I'm all ready to go. Hang on. Say goodbye to my girls. <laughs> the look of a teenager. Don't film me. Bye. Be good. You can text me anytime, okay? All right, bye-bye. Moving to our third gate. I didn't really talk about going to the second gate because I, it was a really crowded area and I wasn't positive we were actually gonna stay there, which is true. We are on to our third gate, clear across the other side of the airport. So taking a train and headed over, I'm just checking my flight. We're in time. So, yep, we're going to a new gate now. Hopefully we'll be on time. I'm doing this in front of everyone, so that's okay. So now our plane isn't even here yet. Delayed. It's fine, because I have so much time at the airport on the other end that I'm not worried about it, but I'm just getting annoying. If we have to change gates again, it's gonna be annoying, but now I'm charging my phone. This is half power now, so. Now I have even longer before I'm on the plane, I can charge it there, so let's charge it up and see you next. to get out of work. So I just went ahead and got myself a little snack, a pretzel. I'm just gonna sit here and hang out. Wait for her to get off work. All right, I'm outside. My sister called a while ago. We chatted for about six minutes and then I think this is her car. She's calling me but I'm literally like right in front of her. She's like right there, still calling me, but I'm right in front of her. There she is. She's gonna love being on camera. I love making fun of her. Hello, hello. You love the camera. Howdy. Howdy, howdy. All right, Erin, say hi. Hello. Guess what, I didn't throw up on the plane. That's really good, Dana. <laughs> And I handed out my small victories. My cuisine to other passengers. I heard them talking about like being oh, super really? sick on planes. And I was like, actually, I've got 100 pills I can share with you. <laughs> and they're like, nice. what? No way. 
so I gave her like five or six of them to make sure she got all of her connecting flights and then the return flights and stuff. So You're such a good little neighbor. I'm such a or good girl. Whatever it is. Anyway, so we're gonna figure out what we're doing right now and then Yes, we gotta figure out we'll be back. Because we have like three and a half hours to kill. Yes we do. <laughs> and only an hour and a half to drive. Yeah. So all right. We'll be back. Okay. Oh my gosh. I forgot that the sun is still shining in yes. Utah. So I don't have sunglasses, so this is gonna be interesting. But uh, we stopped at Wendy's really quick to just, we don't wanna spend a ton of money, but we wanted to sit down and eat because we have time to kill. And then Erin said that her package with um, her wedding gift for this wet shower didn't show up yet. And so she's gotta go find a gift. And she's going to our family's bridal shower on Saturday, so she'll be able to use that gift for that shower. She just wants to show up with something today. So we have to go find something. But you think you're gonna go to Kitchen Needs? I don't know. Or find something down here? I can't decide. So, we'll figure that out, but we're gonna get some dinner. Oh, she's still gimpy. Are you still I am boots? still kinda gimpy. Oh, you're not wearing a boot though. No, I'm not wearing a boot. That's good, it's it's progress. Just the tendon is tight, so it doesn't allow my ankle to move. Like oh. All right, well, I won't film you being all limpy. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right, we just finished eating and we got these bags all packed up. Got that one here and that one over there. And then we're gonna go get something from Aaron, right? Yeah. All right, and I changed my clothes because it's like 78 degrees now. <laughs> yeah, it's like suffocating. It's just hot enough that I'm wearing like <laughs> denim leggings and yeah, yeah. a long... I'm wearing black slacks. Full length. <sighs> anyway, so I changed my You're clothes. I've got shorts on. You come from 50 to 80, there's yes, like I know, I know. 30 degree temperature difference. So anyway, we are gonna go find something for her to get. And we need to come up with our jingle still. That'll I think do. of that. Do. Oh, that's oh not rehearse. <laughs> I was thinking I could go forward, but then I thought oh, that would have been go funny go to go catch on camera. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. <laughs> Over the curb. Down a ravine, yeah. So we needed a little jingle to go with the Oreos. So if you don't know, if you're new, I feel like sometimes I repeat myself, but if you're new, you don't know what the deal is. So Jason, my husband, eats all of Katie's Oreos every single time we're together, without fail, in Hawaii or at our house or even at my mom's house <laughs> during the summer or like at the pool and stuff. Oh, I'm gonna get my Frosty, it's gonna melt into my purse. So we're trying to think of a fun little jingle to do that with that from him. Where did my phone go? And she's like queen at jingles. I'm pretty good. Little poems or something like that. Okay, what are you looking for? I found it, my phone. Okay, so I'm gonna come up with that really quick and then we'll let you know what that is. She's just sad that she won't see you. I know, Maybe Aaron just told me that she told my secret to another sister-in-law. <laughs> so ever, all the sister-in-laws know it's okay. Angie is trustworthy. Oh, I know. It's totally fine. Okay, so we wrote this jingle. This is about the Oreos. Jason eats my sister's Oreos everywhere we go. In Hawaii, when they're $8 a bag. So he's eaten like three bags on different vacations before. And then every time we come home to Utah, anytime she comes to visit. Anyway, so I got five bags of family size Oreos for her from him. So this is the jingle we just came up with. I'm not terribly pleased with it, but it'll do. I know, we're just in a rush. We are almost there, and we have like 30 minutes until we're there. So this is the jingle. And also like double chin. I don't know, I'm like so scrunched down in the car. <laughs> I can't like <laughs> lift up my neck. Oh yeah. Excuse me, just drinking my frosty. Okay, so this is what it says. From Jason to you, we bring you this treat. He promises that this time he definitely won't eat. So between you and Brandon, that's her fiance's name. Your single status dies as now the time has come to upgrade to family size. I think it's kind of cute. What do you, I mean, I, we did pretty well. I know. It's not our best. If we had, I don't know. If I haven't, we had gone into a song. I know. I was trying to like different. think of a song the other night and I just couldn't think of one. And so yeah. that always like helps. Oh shoot, the battery died. Okay, so I'm going to change the battery. We're going to get to the party and then... We will surprise my sister. It'll be super fun. She doesn't know. <laughs> 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 
as now the time has come to upgrade to family size. style for nightgowns but I'm just saying it fits your style yes all right you guys I just took off my makeup before ending the video today on oh, my face is like driving me nuts today we had a really good time I did not film because Katie my sister does not like the camera in her face except for when I embarrassed her and um, surprised her yes so it was a fun surprise I totally caught it on camera but my battery was ready to die so um, it was kind of funny, um, let me just kind of explain the scenario that we kind of ran into. When we got into town, we were early, and we called, or my mom called us, and she told us that um, my sister was going to run some errands. And the three places, that, whoops, sorry. And the three places she was gonna go to were literally right around the corner from where we needed to go to to buy errands gift giver yeah and so we were like oh we can't even go anywhere near because she's gonna totally see us and so we kind of had to stall and kind of drive it through town and go slow and whatnot and so then someone else called us I think my, my mom called us again and said okay she's got to the house so you're safe um, but don't come up to the neighborhood now and so we did the shopping and then my dad called us and said that they had left the house and were on their way over to our neighbor's the house shower. that was yeah. doing the shower. They just lived like two, ho two houses over. Yeah. And so they just walked over. And then um, my sister called, my other sister called me because she was heading into town. She lives outside of town. So she was heading into town and needed to go drop the, her kids off at my mom's house so that she could come to the shower and so I told her that I needed her to come to me at the store we were at <laughs> to get my charger to charge my camera battery so that I didn't run out of battery in order to film the surprise. So she came, got the battery, took it to my mom's house, charged it up there. We waited to make sure that she got over to the shower. Um, and then we went to, then we went over to the, the shower, the bridal shower. <laughs> So it was like like this whole progression of like, can we go yet? Can we go yet to the next like place along the way? It was kind of fun though. It was it kind was, of like it was exciting. My dad was all like, okay, the eagle has left the nest. They have walked over to the neighbors. You know, it was kind of fun. It was funny. And then it was just fun. All of because you saw like a very short glimpse of all the ladies that were there. Um, for this bridal shower and it's all the people that I grew up with. Like it's all my yes. mamas, right Erin? Yes, definitely. So it's like all of these. All the women we love. Yeah. We just grew up with them. They were our, they leaders, were our leaders at, at yeah. church and girls camp and yeah. just in general, like our neighbors and we just love them all so much. And so one, it was great to be there with Katie and surprise her and embarrass her and all that kind of stuff. But it was also fun to just be with all these ladies and and share in that with Katie because they were all so excited for her. They've, you know, they're just like mamas to her too. And so they're like, our daughter's getting married. You know, they all kind of feel the same way. And so 
it was fun to just chat with them and have a good time. And then um, we just kind of wound down and helped clean up and and then Andy left and put her kids to bed. Yep. And um, anyway, Katie doesn't like to be on camera so there's no way I could have pulled this yeah. out and filmed her but she was headed to see her fiance. He's sick I guess and so she was on limited contact to make sure she doesn't get <laughs> yeah. sick, right? Yeah. Um, so anyway, I'm excited. We're gonna go to her house. Maybe I'll get the camera out again at her house because Doobie, yes. Doobie, I'll, maybe I'll, we'll film Doobie. We'll film Doobie. He'll get super that. excited when I come over, when anyone comes over, to yes. be honest. Yes. So we'll do Doobie just so that my kids can see Doobie. And are you gonna bring him up for the wedding or no? Is that too much? He'll probably have to come up because, well, unless we leave him with somebody in Salt Lake, because both of us are going to be gone. Oh, that's the true. The house will be empty, so he'll, either we have to farm him off to a neighbor, or he'll have to come with us. All right, he'll probably do okay at Mom's. Yeah, he loves the kids. Yeah, so I think it'll be fun. That'll, anyway, we'll, we'll occupy the kids yeah. in between the, re the luncheon and the reception while we go and help set up. Anyway, so we'll film Doobie, Doobie at her house, and then we'll end the night. And I have to get up bright and early and go back home. Yep. So, alrighty, we'll go home and see Doobie first. You are Doobie, Doobie, Doobie. Hi, <laughs> say hi. You want me to play with your toy? You want me to play with it already? Okay, we gotta go out here. Come on. Come on, hi. <laughs> Did you miss me? Go. That's the only time I'm gonna do it. Is that mean if I only do it one time? <laughs> Hi. This hair is so long. Okay, maybe I have to, really I have to go to the bathroom. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm gonna, Come on, let's go outside. Come on. I'm gonna give it to Aaron. Should we give it to Aaron? Yeah, you you're gonna play games now. No, leave it. I gotta go potty. <laughs> I'm glad. Turn it off. <laughs> I'm so glad that the camera was facing me. I almost, Kathy, I almost had their camera facing her. She's seriously sitting here with her pants down around her ankles. Uh, well, hurry and get your pants on. Don't turn that off. I'm, it's on me. Well, I don't want the world knowing about pants on. <laughs> I do just think it's funny now. I have something for Aaron. And so. Okay, Doobie, I'll play with you. Hang on. I know, it's cute. Ah! Oh my goodness. Doobie, I'm, I gotta see Aaron for a minute. Oh. <laughs> you're never gonna let me go to bed, huh? As long as you're throwing. I know. Gonna... Okay, Aaron's ready. Sorry, Doobie. Aaron's ready. Hang on. One more. One more, no, uh-uh, put it down. Walk away, back up, uh-uh, back up. Leave it. Back up. Okay, we'll play. Yeah, that's right. Okay, now you have pants on. And we all look like it's the end of the day. That's cute! I forgot to give it to you. It's fuzzy! Do you like it? I do! So you gotta find the good ones. That's a good one. The ones that like speak to you. I had another one in my cart. And then I saw that one. I was like, yep, that's it. Yeah, that's a good one. Thank so it's like you. actually like fuzzy. Yeah, I know. I noticed. I to show Kathy. Thank yeah. Kind of cool, huh? Yeah, very cool. Thank you. Doobie, I'm trying to pack my bag for tomorrow. <laughs> Just giving me like the most pitiful little look because I won't throw his toy. You want me to play with you? You're so excited. You need to calm down and go to bed. No. He's just looking at his toy. I think it's time to calm down and go to bed. It's like 11 o'clock. Okay? Can you go get in bed with Aaron? Take your toy. Go to bed. Okay? He's so sad. Are you so sad about that? Okay. Night-night. I'm sure this isn't the last we're going to see you tonight. 